I know you'll spend the weekend trying to dissect that one, but what's your initial reaction? No good enough. Team that deserved to get through the tie, won the tie, and Inverness, hands down. Um, we've let people down tonight. It's a long way for the supporters to come and really want to apologise for the level of performance we put in tonight. I think we've looked at our away form and uh, try to get that first and all important goal to try and gain a bit of confidence on the road. There's no real difference between Inverness and Kilmarnock. I, I say that honestly and we spoke about that with the players. There's a good level of play here at Inverness. You know, the top end of the Championship compared to the bottom end of the Premier League, there's not a huge difference in it. Um, and you've got to work so hard to, for every quarter and every inch gain to go and try and show your abilities. Um, we never lost tonight because um, of certain reasons, but we lost tonight because the team had more desire, had more energy about them. The team that treated it like a cup tie more than what we did won the tie. And that is hard to say, but it's a fact. And we need to accept that. It's no easy for a manager to say that about his players. Um, it was a disappointing night all round. We, we came up here full of optimism. We, we've backed ourselves as a good cup team, and I want us to have that demand on ourselves to, to go back to Hamden. And we've missed an opportunity. We've missed it, and you know that's something that we'll all regret. For that will stick with us for a while. This one, um, but what we've got to now do is just really put all our energies and focus. And if there's one slight scant consolation tonight, it means we can just full throttle concentrate and leave business. But such a poor night from us tonight. You mentioned there supporters travelled in numbers. Visibly frustrated that then there. What assurances can you give them that we'll get a reaction next week? Yeah, I think we've. Whenever we've put in a, a really poor performance, we've normally got that reaction. Um, it's important that we try and address what we need to address this week. We need to get an identity about us, we need to know exactly what we are, we need to evaluate exactly what it's going to take to win enough points to stay in the league. That was the priority when we got promoted last season. And it's still the priority. The Cups should be important to us, and they are, but we've missed an opportunity. Um, we're sitting in a position in the league where we can still take care of our own business. But we've certainly got to take care of it a lot better than we did tonight. Ash, what do you think went wrong tonight? Everything that possibly could go wrong. Um, we started the game really well. We got the first goal. We banged on about how um, all the way performances and getting how important it is to get that first goal. And it, um, yeah, everything went wrong. It's very disappointing. What's your reaction been from the players in the dressing room after that? It's sheer disappointment. It's not good enough. Um, as, as boys, that's on us as players. Um, we know ourselves and it's fully on us and we'll take full responsibility of that performance um, after our first goal. It was a great travelling support tonight. How do you go about repaying that next week? We have to. Um, got nothing but praise for the away fans and all the fans and we've been fantastic throughout and it's just so disappointing that we, we put in that performance uh, and we didn't send them home happy and we'll work hard this week and try and rectify that because it, it, we're in a fight and it's important that we uh, bounce back from this and put in a performance that's uh, capable of winning the game.